Hi, I'm Tassa Monopoly, cosmetic chemist and trainer here at the Institute of Personal Care Science. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make an anti-cellulite cream. Now let me show you how easy it is to put together. Okay, so to get started, I have my water phase here and to this, I'm gonna be adding some glycerin. Glycerin is gonna be really good at hydrating the skin, uh, adding suppleness to the skin and also uh, protecting it from a trans epidermal water loss. I'm just going to give that one a stir. Now I am going to be making a polymeric emulsion today. So this is going to be a lot quicker and a lot easier. So in my bowl is my polymeric emulsifier. This is the Sepi Plus S by Sepic. This is, I love polymeric emulsifiers. For those of you who don't know, it's an emulsifier and really G modifier all in one. So it saves on the selection of ingredients, uh, time, costs, etc. So they're pretty good to use, one of my favorites. Now to this I'm going to be adding some Coco Caprylate. This is a nice light feeling uh, ester and long spreading. You want to have a good balance of both. You do want your cream to be quite longer spreading as you do have a larger area of skin to cover with a an anti-cellulite cream um, because you do tend to get cellulite on your legs, your buttocks, you can get it on your stomach and you can get it on your arm. So they're a larger uh, volume of skin that you need to cover. So you do want it to be long, longer spreading. Now to this, I'm gonna be adding just a little bit of Camellia tea oil. This is a really good antioxidant. And I'm also gonna be adding some Isofol 20. This is a medium skin feel lipid. Okay, I'm just gonna give that one a stir. And once it's all homogenous and milky looking, like so, we're just gonna add it into our water face. And we're just gonna give that one a stir. Now, it will look all lumpy and separated in the beginning. The key is to keep mixing and it will turn into a beautiful, glossy, smooth emulsion. Okay, so now for my added extras and actives. So my active, my anti-cellular active I'm gonna be using is the Shape Perfection by My Bell. Now this is a liposoluble anti-cellulite slimming active. So it visibly reduces the appearance of cellulite and effectively shape body contours and reveals a slimmer figure. So it typically burns fat and fights cellulite. It contains some spicy substances to fight the cellulite and then excess centimeters. Now there were some clinical studies performed for eight weeks showed that um, there were rapid and strong visible slimming and anti-cellulite effects. So you can see here some more study results of the conversion of white adipocytes into brown-like adipocytes. So you can see that in the table here. There's also some studies of increase of the blood microcirculation after a single application. So that's using 2% of the shape perfection. Um, and you can also see some results here of the slimming effect on the waistline. So there was reduction of the waist girth and there was also a reduction of the abdomen girth. Down here, there's also some anti-cellulite effects on the thigh. So you can see some before and after photos. So after four weeks, there was a 16.6% .6 reduction. And after eight weeks, there was 18.2% reduction of the cellulite. So some really good data for the shape perfection there. Now I am going to be adding some tocopherol. my preservative, I'm just using the Spectrostat. I'm gonna add in some coffee extract as well. This is widely known for firming and toning, so it's gonna be good for cellulite as well. And I'm also gonna be adding some pineapple extract. And I'm just gonna be adding in an essential oil. I'm just gonna use some grapefruit. This is gonna give it a nice um, uplifting citrusy and sweet sort of scent. Okay, just give that one a stir until it's homogenous. Okay, so we're just going to check and adjust our final pH. And as always, we're just going to cover and leave it sit overnight. 
Okay, and here's what my anti-cellulite cream is looking like the next day. really nice and buttery and quite soft and it's long spreading as well so a little bit is going to go a long way which is good for the volume of skin that we will be covering it's also non-sticky it's not heavy either and it's not greasy it kind of dries um, into a nice emollient sort of skin feel well there you go that's how easy it is to create an anti-cellulite cream if you enjoyed today's video please give it a thumbs up leave any questions in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to receive notification on the rest of our videos happy formulating